Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. Um, so today we are gonna pull out the uh, KA24DE out of the white chassis. This is uh, an uh, 240SX uh, hatchback. This is the S13. So yeah, um, we're pulling the motor out. You know, someone's gonna buy it. You know, so uh, because I'm gonna go a different road. Um, uh, we're planning to go 1J, you know, and uh, we have to, you know, get as much as we can. So, as you guys can see, I already have the harness, the harness, the ECU harness all out. You know, it took me like 45 minutes to pull it out from over there. Um, I just drained that, uh, the coolant and I pulled the radiator out disconnected the coil all the wiring you know uh and also well you know the batteries on the back already so i didn't have to do anything over there um i still gotta disconnect the air conditioner um i just drain it that on uh, the transmission fluid uh we i took out the, sh the shifter you know uh we took out the bumper the front bumper. Um, that's the tranny fluid. That's the center console. My brand new Mishimoto radiator. Oh, we took out. I took out the exhaust, the fender. You know. So. Yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, take out the dry shaft and all this stuff. You know, and then. And then uh, one of my boys coming over just to help me push the car out because on the ramp now, and I'm stupidly, you know. I can't take the car, I mean, take the motor out because the car is facing in the garage and there's no space here to bring the hose, the hose in here. So I will have to turn the car around and, you know, work from there. Um, so yeah, um, like I said, my plans are going 1J um, uh, with an R154 transmission, you know, we're looking about 3,200, you know, one, one, and one of those uh, JEM uh, engine depot. So yeah, uh, total cost is about to get the car running and everything is about 6,000 because the harness, the wiring specialty harness is about like almost a thousand. So I was, I was looking the other day around, it was like, I was like, wow, this is crazy. I can't believe that um, compared to RB25 harness, it's like what's, um, the RB2500 uh, uh, turbo harness, I uh, was looking at it, it was like 450, so. And then we need that uh the 1J, you know, to 240SX chassis, uh engine mount, transmission mount, that's like 150 from excessive uh, work. Um and then um also I need to upgrade it to a uh better clutch, you know, uh stage stage three clutch. So uh, yeah. So yeah, um and this car I already have upgraded uh coilovers. Brakes, these are PBMs. Uh, front uh, tension rod, this is the angle kit from Voodoo 13. Um, yeah, we're just gonna go ahead and uh, I think Fran just got here on the van, so we're gonna push the car out now and then uh, turn the car around and then uh, uh, fucking uh, take the motor out. I still got shit in my nose, man. <laughs> no, I left it alone a while ago. So here we're just turning the car around, you know. Uh, we took out the power steering, man. Everything, man. Um, the air, the AC, you know, the fucking shit came out all over the place. So whatever. Uh, yeah, man. No JDM drift. Uh, yeah, car sitting pretty low. I think we're gonna work it up from here. So, um, the motor's gonna come out. This is the best thing you can fucking use. I don't even use a belt. Oh, seat belt? Seat belt is the best. I love seat belt. I think those are the only things I use them for. <laughs>
that shit in the tie knot. The bow is not. You think it's gonna come loose? No, it'll it'll loosen. It's not that mount's not threaded. The bolt's just holding it. So the bolt's off. The engine will lift right off of it. The screw doesn't have to be out. It'll fall out when we lift the engine up. How old? How old the jack? Who gonna jack it up and get the bolt? How many bolts you got? There's two left. There's two left. Those two Transmission? Left in the back. No, in the drive shaft. Oh, okay. And how many in training? Uh, Chinese too. I've already got the the support from the. He took the. The housing. Number, the four. Fourteens. No, the dry shaft. Uh, the housing, the bell housing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The two fourteen, yeah. Um, and what about the tranny mount? Tranny mount is, is still there. Okay. So those are fourteen. It's not a little big. Give me some slack on this side. No, no, you gotta loosen it up. Completely. I'm gonna some slot. You good? That's Kelly's grandma. She's gonna be like, what the fuck? What is going on in here? So hopefully this thing won't slide down, man. No. So we're gonna jack it on the side? I don't think we'll go in there. No, right. this is the low power file. The blue one? Yeah. Yeah. No. Well, I think it, it will. Let me just. You got holes that running from the manifold. Uh, you got rubber holes? Yeah. Yeah, that's why I said we gotta take the exhaust. What, the EGR? Oh, yeah. that's the. Uh, that, the hose yeah, that's the fucking EGR. It comes all the way out to here because it's, you know what I mean? Yeah. That's why you gotta take, take this off and we can slide the exhaust down and out. That's, uh, that's a 17, I think. You know, we're gonna come off that easy. <laughs> mm. Nah, let's use that, uh, the other wrench. I think it's bigger than that. I have a big one here. Yeah, that's the other one is the EGR bolt. I don't think there's nothing in there. I don't know. Oh, but you know what? We can't take this exhaust off because the we're pulling it from the exhaust. <laughs> yes, that's. Why we have that hole? Go under that hole. How far that thing come it's, out? It's a nipple all the way to here. Yeah, but or I'm saying. Take see where the what you call that? The uh, second um, um. Yeah, this. No, down. This is the flange right here. You just not gotta, that. Look, Nick, the rubber hose. This. How, yeah. All right. If you take that clamp off, how no, far is that piece out? No, it's all the way to here. <laughs> all right. That's what I'm saying. So we have to. Well, unless we want to release it, push the. Well, I mean, we gotta fucking figure a way out. Not just put the uh, pull that manifold out. I mean, it's not like you're not gonna use this, right? No. Just fucking chop that off. I just like, man, the, the grinder won't fit in there. Yeah, yeah. So, no. Yeah, Alex, what do you think? Nothing we do. Let the, that uh, the, EG, the EGR two, the EGR, huh? It. It's not about cutting it. No, the it's fucking the nipple that sticks out, the metal part, because it's. So your nipple's out. <laughs> the nipple's out past that seam <laughs> column. Yeah. See. See this. This nipple is all the way to, he to here. Yeah, that's the EGR that connected to the... Because it's, it's an add-on. Okay. So I'm the manifold. Here? Oh. <laughs> Can't take that off. 
That's why I usually do it to one of You got a little problem now. Loosen the steering rack. The rack is like mad. The shaft. The shaft? Yeah. Yeah, you know what? I think the trend is gonna it's gonna grind the floor. Because it's not enough altitude. The shaft, you want to loosen up that shaft? I think it's better though. Like right there, yeah. No, it's connected. Wait, 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 wait. There's still a bolt in here, boys. That's you your bolt. Get a 14. <laughs> you need a 14. Hey, hey, hey. A oh, 17, is it? 17, that's what I meant, man. Hold on, hold on. I thought it took a bolt. <laughs> All right, well, so forget about that one. Uh, All right. Oh, there you go. That's up. Shit, you okay? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know where the oh. nut went, but the nut is here. The wrench. Oh, yeah. The sucker is here. I got it. It, it rolled forward. Exactly. Yeah, wait, wait, wait. The fuel line. The fuel line. Right, Fuck. The fuel line is still up. Cut it. Yeah, just cut it. You missed. No, I got a. Uh... Yeah. Uh, give me that knife again. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Yo. Oh, that's that. Uh, Woo, right the AC right. line. The uh, the the heater. The heater. <laughs> the heater. You good? Yeah. There's a bag in the van there. Get on the back. I know it's like salty and sour. I already tried it once. It's the worst shit ever. Whoa, 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 whoa! Bag up, bag up, bag up. Bag up. What happened? You got that gear cable. Yeah, here. Oh wait, 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 wait! That's the uh, the throttle cable. Put it down. Ha! Yo. <laughs> we just so rushed up or everything. Yeah, yeah, let's just push this. Wait, wait, wait. Let me just loosen up here. It's a 14. Yeah, if, we, if we push it back, it'll loosen something. See if we can push this in. It's a 14. On. And hey, you got some tension on that, Mo. Just keep it right oh, there. Oh, right there. Yo. You were talking shit about Vincent? Yo, man, we just, <laughs> we just, shit. we just went through everything. We're now fucking like taking, we, we almost pulled the engine when everything connected. The yeah. throttle cable was fucking up. Well, uh, well how come the pet, how come the pedal is out too? Imagine that like we pulled the pedal out, the, the, the. We did pull it out. Right. Oh, I think I'm gonna get a new one. Here. I don't know. You gotta hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Go down. You gotta go down a little bit and back. Down. Oh, because the train is hitting the firewall. The back of the train is hitting the firewall. No, it's good. Just All right, right, so then just pull it backwards. Right, right. Yeah, pull it this way. Wait, 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 wait. All right, just hold for a little bit. <laughs> Yo, I still needed that though. <laughs> I still needed the chassis. It's good, it's out. Sorry, you're gonna have to bend that up for one day anyway. Yeah, I'll probably cut it or some shit. Whoa, 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 whoa. All right, all right. We're out, we're out. Yeah, you help him guide that. I'm gonna back the van up and we can push it right up on the back of the van. Okay. All right, we'll get the van. We just hold it here? Just back up a little. Yeah. Back up a little right here is good. You just gotta turn this, that's it. I did that. I took out the AGR too, so you don't have to do that shit anymore. Cool. You got a new water pump from here too, I see. Water pump, alternator, fucking thermostat. Yeah, I have a... Water have pump and everything. Uh, I just need rings on... I have another PA that I pulled last night. I'm you got like wholesaling that shit like a Chinese or something? Like the Chinese people? <laughs> Yo. Pour that one out. That, that'll be a K... I don't know. 
26. Yeah, yeah, just hold that trailer straight so you don't bang up your head. Yo, the headlight came out. <laughs> no, you gotta fucking. Wait, 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 you're gonna. You gotta get this wheel here. You gonna put on a pallet? Yeah. Alright, you're going in, sir. Yeah. You just put it. Oh, let it oh, no, no, no. It cleared. Load a little it bit. Yeah, lower. It cleared. No, you're good. Go through. There you go. That's just... All right, uh, we should go in more. We don't want it, like, right on the door. All right, so push it in more. Right. You know, like, this, the sill is good, too, uh -huh. man. You want to put on the dolly so you can roll it further down because you still got to throw this in. No, we get that no, up. No, I put it on the side door. All right, cool. Yeah, I don't, I don't want That's good. Ready to go nah, down? Nah. Uh, push it in a little more, if it can. We're going to sit on the fucking oil pan. Is that good? Bro, I got four of them. If this one gets bent, uh -huh. I really don't care. Okay. Oh, we gotta tap it anyway, fucking for. Oh, yeah, you know what turbo. we can do, Nick? We got those flats. We can tie it. Like yeah. You know, like the seals are good. You know the. Alright. Uh. Oh, let me put this guy. Yep, yep. Gotta clean it up. And probably fucking play with it tomorrow or some shit. Mine's gonna be like that, but hatch. Same, but just hatch. And we're gonna fucking kill the world. That'd be cool though, like S14, S13, like both same car. Hey, yeah, it looks good, man. I like it. Just, it was like this? This car just got painted. Yeah, it's nice. Whoever painted this stage, they fucked this shit up. I need, I need to pay somebody and go, uh, so they can go break their hands or break their head or something. I got a body shop. Huh? I got a body, my boy. That I so, here it is. The engine's gone. Nick just left with the KA. So, you know, the motor's out, you know, less than an hour, you know, it was fast. Uh, it's just now my part, I need to clean up all this shit, all this mess, you see all this grease? I want to clean up everything, you know, take out the, um, the AC condenser, the air conditioning lines, take all that out, clean it, make it look nice. I think uh, pro I might I might repaint it. I might not. I don't. I'm not sure yet. And also, uh, like I say, I might go for a J1, one J. Sorry, or I might go for a uh, RB25 turbo. So, um, I don't know. What do you guys think? You know, I would like to hear from you guys. Cons and pro pro of both engines. I think one J is more reliable. You know and uh rbs i mean they're all about the same it's just you know i guess different company one's nissan another one's toyota but uh yeah um that's pretty much this guys um i'm gonna go ahead and uh cleaning up clean up all these mess that is here out of the garage um thank you thank you for watching guys and uh if you like this video just please give it a thumbs up um we re i really like to hear from you guys what do you guys think about the 1j and the rb so uh, if you guys can help me design, that would be, that would be great. Um, and as usual, you know, um, like and subscribe. And uh, you guys have a good day.